When were you notified? Two minutes before I called Carlson. Where were you? At home. Well, do I need to produce a witness, give you an alibi? How many shovels we got? I got, I got mine. Two shovels, two men, clear path to that door. We're gonna bust our way through that door, and we're gonna find some air in that safety coffin. There's only one thing to do, and that's to live. We looked into all that. Uh, my opinion is the uh, claim made by your patient is not grounded in any kind of reality. Uh, Blair Watson, she was murdered and knife to the throat, but there's a man doing 20 years in county for that. Miss Jones. It's Miss Graves. I'm trying to explain that my concern isn't with regards to safety. I'm talking about the marriage of business and government. I'm talking about the fact that Aspire, the feds, and whomever has the ability to affect the body's motor functions without my permission. <laughs> Don't you think you're being a little paranoid? You really want to hand over control of millions of microscopic robots inside your body to the United States government? Why not? I'm not a criminal. What are you going to do with me? Trade you for my wife and child. You're not a Navy SEAL. You're a disgrace. Son, we can offer competitive benefits. <laughs> I got to be honest with you about something here. Yeah, what's that? Uh, you know, most industries are using green products. You know, everything's eco-friendly this, eco-friendly that. I just haven't jumped on the bandwagon yet. I mean, this stuff's too damn expensive. You know, the products that we're using, they're uh, not exactly the safest. Formaldehyde's our biggest uh, culprit. Uh, as a result, a lot of folks are getting sick around here. You know, it seems like they're sensitive. He'll take it. What? The job. He'll take it. Tomorrow, OK, for him to start? Uh, yeah, yeah, sure, OK. I know that Sarah Good was a devil worshiper. That's what Helen was, too. She made my daughter reject her faith and her family. Well, that must have made you angry. Yes. And it also broke my heart. In her restraining order, Sabrina said you tried to abduct her. I hired a deprogrammer. Almost 20 years ago, I prosecuted a case in which Ms. Dean was brutally raped and murdered. Now, DNA tests and some material has been in a box in some evidence room over all these years. It isn't going to change that. It isn't going to bring her back. Well, I didn't tell you because I knew you'd kill him. And your mother loved him. So why didn't you kill him? Because I don't have murder in my heart. For the ride. This is a multi billion dollar project. How long have we been researching and testing this? I was the first one on the scene. In fact, I was the one who declared her dead. I decided to keep quiet and let the whole town think that the kid was responsible for her death. If the case had ever come to trial, believe me, I would have said something. I'll have to tell my friends on the LAPD who worked the case. They'll be kicking themselves to death. You were LAPD? Yes, I worked LAPD 22 years. You worked the Manson Look, case? Listen. Guys, I'd love to sit around and break bread with you goody goodies, but I got work to do. Here, put that on it. I haven't seen such total annihilation like that since Hiroshima. Somebody's got to tell it to you straight, kid. You gotta take up a new hobby, like math or marijuana. Maybe I should find a new trainer. They don't get fresh with me, kids. I've been in Korea. I've been in this shit. I can still kick your ass. Can we get a 